Almost every internet user has, at some point, created a Gmail account. Many of us also use Gmail as a primary email provider. If you've had your Gmail account for several years, you probably have a lot of old emails that you've never read. You can delete all emails from your Gmail inbox, but you may have some important emails in there too. If you want to delete emails without losing the important ones, you can use Gmail filters. You can filter your emails by entering filter queries in the search bar. Here's how to do it. If you want to delete all old emails before a specific date, you can use the before or older than parameters in your Gmail. Both filters do a similar job, but the before parameter is more specific in that it lets you send emails to the trash folder that you received before a specific date. To do this, you can use the following format. Before colon year slash month slash day. Let's say you want to delete all emails received before December 25, 2021. You'll need to run this query. Before colon 2021 slash 12 slash 25. Alternatively, you can use the older underscore than parameter. Let's say you want to delete all emails older than one day. Then you can use this search query. Older underscore than colon 1D. You can use D for days and Y for years. However, you can't use decimal values here. And to search for 1.5 years, you'll have to enter 182 days. Note that the results for the before and older than parameters may be different. The before parameter also pulls sent emails, but the older than parameter only looks at your inbox. Once you've used either of those search queries, you'll see all emails received before the specified date. To delete them, select the arrow next to the checkbox at the top left corner. From the drop down menu, select the All option. You'll also see a notification that reads Select all conversations that match the search at the top. Select it, and then select the trash icon from the top to move emails to your digital trash can. You can also use the same search criteria to search for emails in the Gmail app for Android and Apple mobile devices. When you're using an Android or iPhone, the only difference is that you'll need to select emails individually because there's no option to select all messages. If you want to learn how to make your own custom Gmail filters, check out the article linked in the description below. See you next time.